current sources in parallel. Let's say we have a current source in this direction and we have one more current source in the same direction. Now its resultant will be let's say this is current i1 and let's say this is current i2 now since both the current direction are same that is this current source also have the same direction and this current source also have the same direction that is in upward direction so its equivalent current source will be like this it will be i1 plus i2 since both the current sources are in same direction so we have to add them let's say this is a now next is let's say first we will separate this now let's say there are two more current source but this time they are in opposite direction let's say this is upward and let's say one more current source but it is in opposite direction let's say it is in downward direction let's say this is current i1 and this is current i2 now its equivalent current source will be let's say we have to we have to draw it is in upward direction or let's say this i1 is greater than i2 so that time this current source will be in this direction because the value of i1 is let's say it is greater than i2 so its equivalent will be i1 minus i2 now next again there are two more possibilities so now let's say let's say two more current sources are connected in parallel but this time this is downside and one more current source on upper side so its equivalent current source will be first of all we have to write let's say this is current i1 and this is current i2 now this time let's say i2 is greater than i1 so if i2 is greater than i1 that time the direction of this current source will be upward and this will be i2 minus i1 now one more possibility is this let's say there are two more current sources in downward direction let's say this is downward and this is also in downward direction let's say this is i1 and this is current i2 so its equivalent current source will be in downward direction also and this will be the addition of i1 and i2 because they are in same direction but in downward direction that's why the resultant current source direction will be also in downward direction so this is about current sources in parallel